This is ribbed, it's long sleeved, goes with a lot. Super cute. I said that about like 900 things. About, about, I can't talk. Another thing that I got is this light pink um, top. It's a little bit bigger than I thought it was gonna be, but I think I can make it work. Um, it just says charged up and it has this cute picture of like old vintage cars on the road with these cute palm trees. Probably my favorite thing that I got from Forever 21 is this Boston tee. I love it so much. You could wear it like with mom jeans or really whatever you want to wear with it. So that's just something that I wear with it. But it has this alien spaceship on it and I'm just in love with it. And it has this like list of tour dates on the back, which I actually didn't know that it had when I first ordered it, but that's a nice bonus. Well, UFO. I'm at UFO. Same thing. And then I got this super cute faux suede choker. It's just in this like tan, light brownish color and it has a nice cute little bow. I also got this light pink, well, dusty pink cardigan. It's super wrinkled. Um, it needs to be ironed really bad. But it is also from Forever 21 and it has a collar. Um, Man, this needs to be ironed. Uh, it has this cute um, little tie in the back. The next few things that I got are pretty miscellaneous. I got this pair of cute jeans. They're just these high-waisted, um, well, they call it high-rise um, pants from American Eagle. I think like that. But the fit's really nice. Um, they're a little bit long because I'm short. Those pants are pretty bunchy on my ankles. I'm not that sure. I shouldn't be complaining that much. There's a a bird just hit the window really hard. A duck just hit the window really hard right in front of us. Right on this window, right behind the camera. I saw it flying at me. But it flew away, so it's not like it died. That's good. Didn't die. Flew away. I got these from Rue 21. I don't particularly like Rue 21. I don't shop there. I haven't shopped there in a really long time, but I went there the other day with my mom and my aunts, and I found these cute shirts. I really liked them, and they were only $3 each. Super inexpensive. It has a cute little collar. It's a v-neck. It's long sleeved. It's actually really soft. Spandex. And then I got the same one in tan. I really like the Joker. I just think it's professional. I mean, obviously there's a reason that they're $3. They're not very good material. The pink one I hadn't even worn yet and I found a hole in it, so. And then I got the same one in white. Don't judge. I like the style. You guys haven't got makeup on the collar yet. Yeah. Okay. The last thing that I got from there is just this cute, green, faded green, long sleeved dress, and it's just flowy and cute. Again, $3. I mean, if you like Rue 21 and you don't really have money to spend on more expensive things like American Eagle and Brandon Melville, then I would suggest going to Rue and looking at their stuff that's on their like three and five dollar racks because sometimes you can find some really cute stuff. And Forever 21 actually isn't that expensive either. Sometimes they have really good sales and their stuff is like seven to twelve dollars. That's how I got a lot of my stuff around that price from Forever 21. So I also got this striped short sleeve shirt. It's one of my favorites. Okay. Moving on to shoes, I got some super good shoes. I love them so much. Um, the first pair of shoes that I got are these super cute black shoes from Forever Young. I love them. They actually are a six and a half, and that is not my shoe size. I wear seven and a half, but they fit super well, and I am just in love with them. They were on sale when they were ten dollars, and I just love them. These super cute white Nikes. My friend Gabby back there actually told me about them. She got the same pair. They go with a lot. They last a long time and they're super durable. The last pair of shoes that I got are these white bands. They're 
They're kind of wet. I washed them because I got foundation on them because I'm cool like that. Anyways, they're super, they're super comfortable except for the fact that they do rub up your ankles, rub against your, rub up against your ankles a lot. So I would recommend getting some of those like ballet type socks um, from any shoe store. Makeup wise, I went to Dillard's and they have this amazing sale right now going on at Estee Lauder and we have this super cute bag that comes with it. You have to buy something that's $35 or more, but for the price that you have to spend for this, I think that it's a super good bargain because you get a lot of stuff out of it. I bought the Double Wear Foundation. I used to wear Cool Bone, but this time I got Desert Beige, which is just a shade darker than that one. And I love this. It's a long wear. Um, Full coverage foundation. Um, it doesn't feel very heavy on your skin, and it's. I really like it. It makes your skin look really soft and dewy. And with the purchase of that, I got these makeup wipes for free, and this bag, and this moisturizer. I got the day where you can pick between this and another one that's more for like anti-aging. Tight and firm. Yeah, it tightens and firms. Um, it smells like cucumber. It's like a light green color, and I love it. It makes my skin feel really good. My moisturizer that I usually use is from Clinique. I love that moisturizer. Along with that, I also got these two lipsticks. This one's in like a very vibrant red. Um, I don't wear this often. I'm sure I can find some time to wear it. Um, regardless, it's a full-size lipstick. Um, the amount of times that I've said um is ridiculous. The other one that I got that I really like that I actually have been wearing recently is this like pinky nude lipstick and I love it a lot. It's super pretty. I love it. Um, this is in the shade Intense Nude. It also came with a brown lip liner but I left that in the other room and I'm going to be honest I'm too lazy to go get it. So. Then from Icing I got these Super cute earrings. They always have sales going on, um, so I recommend going there for jewelry. But I got these super cute like hoop earrings, and they just have a bunch of different little styles. I'm not particularly fond of these ones right here, but I like the rest of them. Then I went to Sephora, and I got um, the Brow is Eyebrow Pencil from Anastasia, Anastasia. Um, it has this super fine tip pencil. I don't know if you can see that or not. On the other end, it has this just nice brush for combing out your eyebrows, and I've been using this for a long time. I really like it. Um, another really good one is the, what is it called? I don't actually know what the name of the one I'm thinking of is, but it's from Benefit, and it's actually super similar to this. It's from their brow collection, and it has like a silver chrome futuristic looking package. Also from Sephora, I bought this liquid Stila eyeshadow that I've been wanting for so long. It's in the color Bronzed Bell and it's just super pretty. It's so like glittery and it just looks super pretty like in the middle of your eyelid. It just looks like that. And then from Ulta, I got the Shape Tape Concealer in the color Light Sand. I actually had this before, but I left it at a friend's house and I didn't get it back. It's super creamy, it's super blendable, and I love it. This is my favorite concealer I've ever used. It's a full coverage concealer. On the package, it says that it is shea butter and it's sunflower. Then it has licorice root and vitamin E. And it is grown. Cruelty free. And then I got this liquid black eyeliner from Stila. I have been using the brown one. I really like brown, but I recently have been liking black. It makes my eyes pop more. Uh, but it's just a super precise to fine tip, and I really like it for doing winged eyeliner. I don't like to do intense wings, but I like to do a subtle wink every now and then. It's in the color Intense Black and it's waterproof and it is the Stay All Day liquid eyeliner. 
And then I got this Hangover Primer from Too Faced. I have heard a lot of things about it. I really, really am enjoying the smell of this. It smells so good. It's, um, it's white and it, it's really creamy. It smells delicious. It is the Replenishing Face Primer. It says that this is made with coconut water, probiotic based ingredients, and Skin Revivers. It says that it's proactive and nourishing and that it's silicone free. So if you are near an Ulta, I would consider getting this because I've heard really good reviews on it. <laughs> but I don't, that's the thing. What's up? Come on, come on. Come on. <laughs>